going to be doing a small video because I wanted to show you this new blush I got. It is from Sanrio and it's only for sale in Korea, this says. I got it from a shop in Halifax called Moon Moon Cosmetics and it's Guratama! It's so cute! This is the cherry colored blush. I not sure if they have actual names. It says Lazy and Joy on it, but they might all say that. I believe there was three different colors, but I got this one because I thought it would look pretty cute. So today I'm going to just try this out and tell you what I think in case you're thinking of buying it too, or if you just feel like watching me video. So first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take off these gems and little stars and hearts that I have on my cheeks so I can actually have a place to put the blush. Now my cheeks have no makeup on them, no foundation, no primer, nothing. So I'm going to open this. There's a little piece of tape right here closing it. So I'm going to take that off. All right, so when you open it up, it looks like this. Oh, there's a little Kuritama. How cute. It's a little sponge. Oh, there's a fancy mirror. Ooh. And then, oh, whoa, okay, that's cool. So there's a little part where the sponge, oh, mm, that's cute. I did not know that this would be so cute. So you take the little powdery sponge thing out and then you can open this and there's the actual color. So the color is this orangey red I feel like it looks a little bit different in person, a little bit more red in person. I think this will be really cute for Igari style kind of blush and makeup. So I'm going to put this underneath my eyes using the little sponge it came with. So the blush is a really wet kind of consistency, which makes me think it'll blend in really easy, which is cool. Very creamy. So in person right now, I am loving this. I think it's so cute. I think it looks a lot more red in person than it does on camera, so I might add a little bit more so the video can pick it up a bit better. But oh my gosh, I really liked how this applicator worked. I just dabbed it onto my cheeks and I think that it looks really not natural, but it's blended in. It's not just circles of the blush. I think it's so cute and I could probably rub it in to blend it more if I wanted to. It feels so soft, oh my goodness. I love that. Okay, that is so cute. I'm gonna add more so that the camera can pick it up. So you can probably tell there is a lot of blush on my face, so I'm gonna blend this a little bit. Just with my fingers, cause I am a makeup artist. Just kidding! Okay, I think this is so cute. I'm loving how this looks. I feel it looks very sunburnt, which I think is so cute. And it's so soft. Like, if you have the Urban Decay face primer, it, it kind of feels like that. Just how it's so soft. I also don't feel like I'm wearing anything on my face. It feels so good oh my goodness and i think it is so cute i love the color i would love to wear this with a yami kawaii look if i'm trying to go for a really sick kind of look with my makeup i just oh i think it's so cute i love this i'm not really sure what else to say i really like this it goes on really soft it's a very creamy blush and the red color is so cute with a little cherry on it the packaging is 10 out of 10, very cute, very kawaii. I love cute makeup very much because you can just display it. If it's on my dresser, it doesn't look messy. It's like another decoration. So that's it for this video. I hope that you liked it. I hope you could learn a little bit about this blush in case you thought about buying it for yourself. And have a great day. Bye.